Hey, how are you? This is a computer guy. I am um, doing a tutorial on uh, the installation of a copy of TurboTax Home and Business 2012. Uh, this particular one is going on a Windows 7 uh, computer. Um, as you can see in the on the screen of the monitor that there's no uh, TurboTax icon installed. Uh, this particular one is a um, uh, TurboTax Home and Business 2012. So I'm doing a, an, an <clears throat> instruction or a uh, uh, tutorial on how to uh, install this on your computer and use it to do your taxes. Uh, basically, you put it in your CD. Um, <clears throat> and uh, in just a few minutes, a um, uh, window should pop up. Um, okay, the Windows Auto Place, a DVD 2012 Turbo Tax Home and Business uh, window popped up. Um, so, what we will do is go down to um, open folder view file. Okay, then the next option will go to TurboTax uh, 2012 um, folder. And this will take us to another page which gives us four options. The option we want is the TurboTax 2012 installer. Uh, from there, this will take us to another page. Um, well, this right here is basically saying, do, did I confirm or did I make these changes or want these changes to happen to this computer? I'm going to say yes. Okay, so we can actually uh, make this small or close that particular one out. Okay, so we got the welcome page uh, with Home and Business, TurboTax Home and Business 2012. Uh, we're going to agree to the license agreement. Um, how do we get an update? Uh, you can go, you can do it automatically. You can do it, uh, ask me first scenario, or you can do your updates on your own uh, per choice. And also, as you can see, there's no icon with the turbo tax on the screen as well. I don't know if I've already mentioned that or not. But uh, we'll go to next. We're going to do automatic updates. Uh, we're going to keep it in the same program file. And then it just basically give you an overview of what you've done. We're going to go to install. Okay, we got the preparing and installation page. Um, which in the right hand corner you have a percentage bar that tells you you know when it's fully installed at 100 percent etc um... after this completes it should be an icon that pops somewhere up on the screen uh... where you can go or you can just go straight in uh... when it says uh... install so it's installing so at 24 percent now Uh, there would be a link um, given to this um, um, tutorial, which were in the Craigslist ad. Um, and it's just basically showing y'all that the CD does work, so, um, and how to install. And we do have uh, other uh, TurboTax products, Deluxe, Premier, uh, business as well, and it's regular standard if you need it. Um, also have it from all years. We can get it and um, just let me know what you need and we can get it for you. The email address is uh, getmycdnow at aol.com or getmycdnow at gmail.com okay it's at uh, 76 percent okay it's 98 uh, percent so this now it says TurboTax 2012 is installed um, the icon did pop up over here in the left hand corner as well on the screen so we can go to launch TurboTax now which will take us to the TurboTax home and business uh, to it page <sighs> uh, 
okay they have a updates that are, are available uh, we can go here to let you see that these updates does work we're gonna do update now because some softwares out there don't allow you to do updates without corrupting it so uh, this is a, a real good version of this um, TurboTax uh, Home and Business 2012 and as I said earlier we do have multi-year um, turbo taxes so if you need anything from 05 06 04 uh, just give me an email um, call at uh, get my city now at gmail.com or get my city now at aol.com So as we can see, we have uh, I guess one minute left. It is installing the updates and for the forms and for the program now. And once again, this is a Windows 7, and it does work on Vista, XP, etc. This particular brand is a uh, is a Windows XP or Windows 7. Sorry. Okay, uh, now we come to the updater page for TurboTax. It says everything has been updated successfully. Uh, now we're going to go down to the OK. Now it's going to restart TurboTax. And um, this page right here just basically keeps you updated with the tax laws. I never fill this out. So you can hit continue. Then they're going to ask you, Do you, are you sure you want to continue? Just say yes. That's up to your discretion if you want to fill that out. Um, so what we have here is um, TurboTax Home and Business 2012. Um, this is the welcome page. Uh, you can begin and you can ask what you want to do. If you want to start a new individual or prepare uh, W-2s or 1099 for contractors or employees, um, that's up to your discretion what you want to do. I'm going to start new return. Okay. And so then you have a, I have a transfer page where you can transfer existing files that you had prior or in the past. Uh, if it's on your computer now, you can transfer it over long as in the uh, format. Um, and that's it. We're not going to uh, transfer anything. Um, so you have your personal info, your business, personal, state, taxes, all the things that's enclosed in the original version. Um, uh, the business part. Let me see. Find some business deductions. If you you know you have a business, if you want to tie it in with your personal, that's pretty much all right. You can explore your own, and then it has a list of things that you can go through and down and see, as well as more. So, um, and that is about it. So you can subscribe and um, uh, once again that email address is get my CD now at gmail.com or get my CD now at aol.com and this is a tutorial how this turbo tax home and business 2012 works and uh, the listing is on Craigslist so if you type in uh, turbo tax home and business or anything dealing with tax software it should come up with all the other goodies um, you have a good day bye, -bye.